a teacher suspended with pay after allegedly being overheard referring to a student as a monkey. But many are still calling for the educator to lose his job, and this process is far from over. News 12's Kevin BC joins us now with what comes next for that teacher and district leaders. Kevin. And Macy, that announcement was made just moments ago during a school board meeting here at Amityville High School. In fact, that meeting is still happening as we speak behind those doors. The school board telling the people inside that room that they find there's enough evidence to move forward with a hearing and possibly seek the termination of that teacher. Be it resolved that the employee named in confidential schedule A is hereby suspended with pay. And with that, the Amityville School Board announced its decision to keep a math teacher and coach out of the classroom pending the results of a hearing after the educator, who is white, allegedly used a racial slur while talking about a black student athlete. In this video obtained by News 12, you can hear someone say the word monkey after referencing Howard Cosell, a sportscaster who was accused of making a similar racist statement decades ago. Tonight, outraged parents spoke about the pain the comments have caused. We cannot allow someone to come in our area to oppress us. While teachers and coaches stood in solidarity with the community. The comment that was made does not reflect the morals or the beliefs we have worked so hard to instill within these young men. No student deserves to be dealt with in a manner in which there is racism. If the teacher is found guilty, the school board says it will seek termination. But the process could take months, which left some in the community dissatisfied by the decision. What is there to investigate for four months? The tape's going to change? The audio's going to change? What is the four months for? So it sounds like there's still a ways to go with this. Kevin, what is the next step in this process? Right, Macy. So first, the teacher has to be formally notified that there will be a hearing, and then both sides will have 125 days to submit evidence. You saw that person frustrated about the fact that that step will take some time. Then the final decision about the teacher's fate will be made by an independent arbitrator. Macy, 